Hey guys, we are Mental Cruelty and uh, this is a short story about our first concerts we ever visited. So, my first show I ever visited was actually Ozzy Osbourne together <laughs> with my father back in I guess 2012 in Germany, in Dortmund. It was like a four and a half hours drive away from home. Um, it was on a working day and I need to go to school the day after but it was literally until that day it was the best day of my life because I finally got to see one of the most um, influential metal musicians I guess and I absolutely love Ozzy Osbourne and I'm the biggest Black Sabbath fan till date. Yeah, and what is your story? Yeah, um, my first concert actually, the biggest one, uh, the bigger one, I the first one. Uh, was like I think the Black Dahlia model because uh, yeah I used to start playing drums with uh, rock band and Guitar Hero yeah that's no joke <laughs> and um, yeah there was a song like what is called uh, what the horrible night to have a curse and that was so fast and it was so smashing like a bulldozer I was so into that band and I listened to them uh, more and. Yeah, also do that music and then I figured out that they are coming to my hometown and I was just like yeah so let's go to the first concert and it was overwhelming it was so fucking stacked that venue you couldn't even move you just had like ah, ah, ah. and if that was also the first experience like in the marsh pit circle pit and all that shit yeah it was an experience yeah <laughs> yeah so the first concert Little Marco went to was probably <laughs> Bullet for My Valentine. I think I was, yeah, I'm guilty. I was 11 years old, 12 years old maybe. And the funny thing about it is that the support bands actually were Ezele Dying and Protest the Hero. And I didn't even bother to watch those bands. Shame on me, yeah, because I think it was only two or three years later that I was really into Ezele Dying and Probably a few months later, I was really into Protest the Hero and yeah, didn't even like Bull from a Valentine anymore, so <laughs> shame on me.